I think people from this generation or the postmodern generation are looking for truth. You know, they don't want people who are fake. Without a doubt, they're looking to be loved and accepted. And my heart breaks because that's, that's what everybody wants. I'm convinced the reason our culture has a loss of truth is because long before that, there was a loss of trust. People hunger for relationships. They hunger for us to really care, not caring just for the sake of our organized religion or our institutions. I think most of what people want is just acknowledge my pain, acknowledge the torment that it is to really live life, and point to some things that are a little bit better. We're in an age of spirituality. People pray, but they don't know who God is. People long for a relationship with that God, but they don't know how to achieve that. One of the struggles for Christianity on the whole is that as the world's changed, the church hasn't changed. My read is that a generation of churches have chosen to keep their traditions and lose their children. And I think that's the greatest tragedy because people are far more important than style and structure, rituals and traditions. We live in an age where many people no longer believe in absolute truth. Because of past violations, their willingness to trust is virtually non-existent. Art and beauty are preeminent. It's music, images, movement. It's all things aesthetic. Not what can be proven, but what can be felt and experienced. And now churches are finding that more and more people are looking elsewhere for spiritual answers. As followers of Christ, the church is therefore being called to embrace this challenge. They've been called to build a bridge to this postmodern generation and to think in new ways about how to convey their unchanging message.